today we consider how we can set default page in ASP.NET web application. Here we have to consider two cases. One, when the project is run from Visual Studio, that means locally, how we can set the default page. Second, when the project is run from IS, means it is hosted on any IS, how we can set the default page. Let's consider the first case, that means setting the default page from Visual Studio. As you can see, this is my solution. And in my solution, I got default.aspx and my page.aspx. I want to set my page.aspx as start page. For that, right click on my page and select set as start page. That's all. Now run the application. You can see my page.aspx is the start page here. So let's consider the second case that means setting default page from IAS. For that, all you need to do is open your web.config and in save system.web server there is a note for default document. You have to place your desired page inside this value segment. Here is one example. This is my website hosted on IS. If I explore this and watch the web.config, you can see I have set inside web.server there is section for default document and I have set my page as start page. Now let's run this from IAS. Yes, we got the output, though it is not showing the file name, but the content is from the mypage.aspx. For confirming that, just navigate to mypage.aspx. Yes, the same content is displayed. So here we have seen how to set default page in ASP.NET web application. We have seen setting default page from Visual Studio and from IAS. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please visit technomark.in for more information.